Product listing ads on Flipkart allows you to advertise your products to millions of customers every day and drive higher traffic and sales. By advertising your products on the Flipkart mobile app, your products get higher discoverability, guaranteed buy now button and increased sales potential. So how can you create an ad campaign? Go to the advertising tab. On this page, you will see your total balance which includes 90% of your cash on delivery, COD balance and your total credits. You can utilize your total balance to create ad campaigns. Get started by clicking on create a campaign now and follow these three simple steps. Select products, set budget and duration, make payment. Step 1. Selecting products. Let's start by naming your campaign. You should name your campaigns clearly. For example, Mobile Nokia Weekend Promotions. This will help you keep a track of them in future and comparatively analyze your campaigns better. Now, select the products that you want to advertise in your campaign, either by selecting from the subcategory or uploading a CSV file with listing IDs. To select products from subcategories for the campaign, click here. Select the subcategories for which you want to create the campaign. The number of listings you have selected will appear here. Determine the type of listing that you want to advertise in this campaign by selecting FA or non-FA. Select the price range for the campaign. This will ensure that all your products from the chosen subcategories and within this price range are added to this campaign. Click on Save and Continue to set budget and duration. You can also upload products in bulk for the campaign. To do this, click here to download the CSV template. Once the CSV file is downloaded, fill in the listing IDs. Please keep in mind the following while you fill in the listing IDs. Do not edit the first two rows. Start filling in from the third row. Enter one listing ID per line. Maximum of 2000 listing IDs are allowed in one campaign. Now, return to the Advertising tab and click here to upload the CSV file. Once the file is uploaded, a confirmation message appears here. Click on Save and continue. Now it's time to set the budget and duration for the campaign. Step 2. Setting the budget and duration. Enter the campaign budget here. You will see the potential number of actions that can be achieved based on your budget. Set the start date and end date that you wish to run the campaign for. Update here if you want to equally distribute the budget for all days of the campaign. This will allocate an equal amount from your total budget for each day of the campaign. If the budget is exhausted for a particular day, the campaign will stop for that day and resume automatically from the next day. You can also run your campaign until the budget ends. To do this, click here and the end date will show as never ends. The option to distribute equal budget for all days will be disabled if you choose to run the campaign without an end date. Click on Save and Continue. Now that you have selected products and set budget and duration for the campaign, let's move to the final step and make the payment. Step 3. Make Payment the amount you have selected for the campaign will be reduced from your total balance and will be reserved for campaign. Total budget of the campaign shows here and the summary of the campaign appears here. Click on Make Payment. Once payment is made, the budget amount will be reduced from the total balance. Click on Proceed to Payment to create the campaign. We suggest you to recheck campaign details before you proceed to payment. Campaigns once created cannot be edited. However, as you move to different stages of creating a campaign, it will save automatically as draft. You can edit a draft campaign, 
until you make payment. Once your campaign goes live, you can pause or abort it. When you proceed to payment and create your campaign, you will see this page which shows the campaign performance once it's active. Budget consumption of this campaign will appear here. Watch the next tutorial on editing an ad campaign to learn about saving and editing your ad campaigns.